Is that normal? That was a pretty good pop, right? There we go. Unlock your full potential at Crack Addicts. So starting off, um, I've been having, and same thing with last time too, I have really bad upper back pain and between my shoulder blades the most, it gets really tight, which causes my muscles to also kind of lock up with that. Uh -huh. um, lower back pain as well. And I experience that a lot. I'll kind of try to pop it myself and even with stretching, but um, I can't really work out my lower back right now. We're gonna start with the neck here. All right. Are you nervous right now? <laughs> I just have to ask because I know you said let you're me, nervous about the neck. Let so. me relax. Yeah, go to your zen place right now. Your happy place. All right, nice and relaxed. We're gonna drop this down, good. Okay. That was good. It's very crunchy. Solid release there. Chiropractor and self-care. It's great. Okay, same thing here, we're gonna drop this down. Good. That was a pretty good pop, right? That was good. Yeah. Very deep. Go hands on your hips for me. Press your elbow back into me. Just like that. Yeah, you don't even have to like, do anything. Yeah. It's always popping. Press back here. Good. Okay. And then relax your arms for me. Good. This is mid back here. Oh. Squeeze your elbows together. Nice and tight. One more time. There we go. Did you get anything? A little bit. Your mid back's tough. Next here. There we go. Nice. That was good. Another one here. Good. And then one down here. Perfect. Nice and relaxed here. Good. You like that one, right? That's my favorite. There we go. Yeah. Good. Thank you. You I'm got like it. patting my back. <laughs> <laughs> Telling yourself good job. And out. Oh my God. Don't put the cussing on camera, <laughs> please. I don't know how to feel about that one. It oh, got it, but it kind of gave me a little bit of a headache. That was like a one out Is of that ten. normal? To have a headache? Yeah. I mean. My head is like kind of pounding right now. Am I dead? No, I'm still not. here. We, but the top of my back feels really good. Well, I think you like this last time. I do, it's because I actually think I have an uneven, it might just be me, but I feel like I'm an uneven person. Good. My ankle even pops. Good release there. Good. Can you still wiggle your toes for me? Everything's I moving? I'm making sure I get paralyzed. <laughs> I'm just messing with you at this I, point. Okay, I was like, are we actually going for that? Yeah, you're all good. Everything was great. Feel, feel okay? Nice. I feel great. My back feels better. My middle back got really released from that. That was good. I think that whenever I get tight there, since it kind of, um, how would I put this? It makes working out harder. It's like whenever I'm doing like the yeah. like squeezing, trying to hit that part, then I feel like my muscles get tighter because they're working harder because my back needs to be popped. Yeah, so, sense, but. yeah, well, if you're tight through your thoracic spine, you have less shoulder mobility. Yeah. Uh, and also your scapulas aren't going to glide as properly. Yeah. So mid-back mobility is very important for being able to work out properly. Well, thank you. You got it. So I have done gymnastics uh, since I was three. I did it for like 10 years. Um, so bending backwards and doing the splits and everything, it... Um, was a lot of pressure on my back and then when I was in the army I did a lot of running on sand and a lot of kitchen duty so uh -huh. that kind of <laughs> messed it up a little more um, and my height and your font size right fun size yes how tall are you um, and my height how tall are you I am four seven you really stiffen up in the lower back though yeah. mm -hmm. for sure definitely your most restricted area these muscles here are overactive too, so. So we're gonna give you the full work over. Work it top to bottom, start at the base of the skull here. See how you're doing. You know, I've had some really big patients, like <laughs> huge patients. I think you might be the smallest patient yeah. I've ever had, like adult-wise, you know? <laughs> yeah. Start with the neck here. A D D magic card. What is a D D? Her name. Oh. <laughs> I, thought you, I thought she was speaking Hebrew or something. All right, I'm gonna drop this down. 
Nice and relaxed. Oh! <laughs> Yeah. Good one. Oh yeah. That was pretty loud. Whew. Are you gonna get adjusted later this week? I don't know. Let's see how she. Yeah. Right. <laughs> okay, I'm good. Wow. Yes. <laughs> She's a little compact, Whoa, I'm a little lightheaded. <laughs> So imagine you guys come all the way from Israel and then we just have a bad adjustment. Like, come on. No, no, This no. one's got to be solid. Yeah. All right. Let's do hands on your hips for me. <laughs> Press your elbow back. No. We'll try them a couple different ways here. Let's do this side. Short one. Press your elbow back. Okay. Let me borrow this arm from you. Bring it up here. There it is. That one was kind of quiet. Got a little bit out of it. Mm -hmm. Squeeze. Yep. Wow. Yeah. <laughs> I hope the mic picked that one up. That was huge. We'll adjust the whole country. Good. Okay. We're going to do one more down here. Yeah. Do okay there? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> There you go. Just like up. Fold here, just like that. So this is low back here. Yeah, this one's gonna go crazy. Good. You're tight in that lower back. Yeah. There it is. You good? You can breathe? Yeah. She's making it. Much better She's now. She's making it so far. Let me go. I need to grab the straps real quick. Oh, Bring yeah. the straps for this. Yeah. One. yeah. So. Oh, First God. time. Literally out of the FedEx. <laughs> I ripped the old ones in half from okay. using them so much. Yeah. Oh my God. So. <clears throat> First time use. Maybe this will be good luck, right? Yeah, maybe. Yeah. Maybe it'll make me taller. <laughs> <laughs> you have the decompression. You've seen this one, right? Yeah. Okay. Lift your head up for me. Back down. So with the decompression, you're gonna fill this down the back. You fill all the vertebrae open up and decompress. Just stay nice and relaxed for me. Yeah. Breath in. Let it out. Oh. Yay. <laughs> you fill it down the back? Mm-hmm. How far down do you feel it? Um, a little bit here, but mostly till here. Like a little down here. Uh-huh. Yeah. That was good though. Oh. oh, my head feels like weird though. Do a pull. <laughs> good one. <laughs> nice. <laughs> All right, you can go ahead and sit up. Oh, How you doing? Good. Feeling pretty solid? Mm hmm. A little bit of loosey goosey. Yeah. Right <laughs> but it's good. Which one was your favorite? Yeah, the decompression for sure. Yeah? Yeah. <laughs> nice. Fingers and anything? You want to get that? Yeah, for sure. <laughs> Let me see. She's not going to pass anything else, right? Uh, I'm She's here. <laughs> She's like, what else you got? Yeah. Elbow, fingers. Let's see if we can get anything. Oh. These are subtle, but you can feel yeah, them. Yeah. Okay. Nice. I knew I had more. <laughs> you got a little bit out of the fingers. Yeah. I can get later. Let's see, how, <laughs> let's see how loud it can be. Nice. Your fingers are the only ones. That's the one that works the hardest. <laughs> I know, she's got like muscles on her fingers. <laughs> Here. Okay. Yeah, that one went easy. There's too muscle in. Yeah. Good. Let me hear what's been giving you trouble. Well, my lower back just, they always say I have my discs, the lower discs are kind of like crinkled, whatever. I don't, I don't understand it. I, but it's just, it all stemmed from probably my motocross days and 
I've never been able to get my back correct. Eight months ago or so, I started having like a real bad, I think it's like a sciatic nerve, because it go all the way down to my back of my leg. And I mean, it got to where I, I used to be all bend over, I used to be pretty flexible, bend over, put my hands flat on the floor. Now I can barely bend over and just get past my knees. Mm -hmm. And is that because you feel like you're restricted or because of the pain? A little bit, I mean, uh, if I wanted to fight through the pain, I could probably go farther, but I mean, it starts to really hurt once I get down so far. When I walked in here, you were telling me about kind of what you used to do when you were younger. Can you tell me about that a little bit? Well, I grew up a farmer and then I got into, I got into bull riding when I was mm, 15, 16 years old and got into all the stupid rodeo stuff, you know, the uh, bull poker. You ever seen anybody play bull poker? No. You put four guys on a table, act like they're playing poker out in the middle of the bowl ring. No when way. When they turn the bowl loose, last man still sitting in a chair wins. Yeah. And then I raced motocross for probably five, six years. And I kind of gave that up. Well, I had a real bad wreck actually racing flat track because I also raced flat track. And I hit a fence and broke a bunch of my ribs. And yeah, I kind of get, and I had a my daughter was small at that time so I, I kind of gave that one up because I was that close to it could have killed me oh yeah <laughs> for sure you could have used a chiropractor back then right <laughs> yeah and I didn't I just started seeing a chiropractor not even two years ago you said you know you've seen a few chiropractors but nobody's really been able to help you so far I haven't noticed much of a difference I mean there's been there's been differences it's in it's definitely things have improved but it's just never really been completely taken care of gotcha so we're down here yeah Especially right here. Yeah. Is that the worst spot? Uh, it's actually about right right there gets the worst pain. Okay. Yeah, I'm very curious as to getting hit by a bull too. What what the spine looked like after that one. I'm not sure it was crooked. You gotta be a little bit of an adrenaline junkie. Yeah, totally. <laughs> That's completely me. Just let it go. Wow. That was good. <laughs> Really solid one there. Do they usually get a good adjustment out of your neck? No. They're no? Mean, small cracks, but nobody ever goes that forceful, and that's what I've tried to tell them to do. It's just, I want it to, I want to hear myself crack. <laughs> I want to feel it all the way down, everywhere. So we're going to do the same thing here. Good. I already got one. All right, good start. <laughs> good start. Let's go ahead and work on these shoulders here. I'm gonna bring this arm up. Just nice and relaxed. Shoulders are tight. Let's bring this arm up. <laughs> that one went really easy. Yeah. Unless you do hands on your hips for me. Okay. Yep, and then press your elbow back into me. Good, press back here. Good. Nice, easy release on that. Good. There we go. Did you feel that one? Yep, I felt that one. We can go in here again. There it is. Back right here, just let this go. There it is. Yep, that's a good one. Nice. Oh, Thanks for the tip. <laughs> Appreciate it. You're gonna fill this down the back. Mm -hmm. I don't need you to do anything. Just stay nice, and relaxed for me. You're gonna fill those vertebrae decompressed on this, okay? So breath in for me. Let it out. Oh my God! <laughs> <laughs> huh. Woo! Hmm. That was a good one. Uh huh. Hmm. <sighs> That's what I've been literally looking for. I felt that all the way down. Oh yeah. That was great. You feel the the lower back open oh, up? Oh yeah. Yeah, I felt everything just feel like it separated. How would you describe it? Can you put that into words? <laughs> I, I don't. I don't really know. I don't. <clears throat> just being stretched out i have no idea how to, how to really describe that you can just feel everything crack all the way down last time i felt my back crack like that is when let's see i jumped off a cliff into the 76 falls into the water of course you did lake Cumberland. <laughs> sounds like something you do <laughs> that's probably what compressed all of it right <laughs> so this is the hip here 
Loud. That was a really loud one. <laughs> nice. That's about a dollar right there. <laughs> that's a good tip. Yeah, that's like the most I've ever gotten. <laughs> Let me borrow this arm here. There we go. Nice. Just relax this arm for me. Okay. All right. How do you feel? I feel really good. I mean, I feel the difference in my back already. Are you feeling the numbness and tingling into the leg? Well, not right now. No. No, it feels way better. That's a hundred times better. We're like with my roommates and we went for a Lollapalooza and everything. So like we were just staying with her and me and my other roommate were sharing couch for like three days. It was awful. Like the worst back pain and yeah. pain I could ever like even imagine. Yeah, we were just like, cause we weren't even like sprawled out on the couch cause it wasn't like a big couch or anything. How long ago was that? A week ago. Okay. What's bothering you the most right now? Same thing. My neck and my spine always in like, just like my back area, but most of it's like it, I think it stems all from my like shoulder and sure. neck area. So we're gonna start with the neck here. I'm gonna drop this down. Nice and relaxed. Oh. oh my gosh, I forgot how these felt. Oh. That was a deep one. I'm telling you, I've been in pain. Like so much pain. Do okay on that side? Yeah, okay. That's good. All right, it's nice and relaxed. There we go. Oh, wow. Thank you. Okay. You got it. Do okay? <laughs> that was great, yeah. Nice. Same thing here. Nice. Let's go on your stomach for me. Good. Do okay there? Yeah. Another one. There we go. To the lower back. Uh, you know what was my favorite one? Which one? The one that was up there. The, one. the decompression? Yeah. We're getting there. That was my favorite. Nice and relaxed. Good. That was insane. Oh. <laughs> Same thing here. <laughs> nice. Oh my god. Good release there too. Yeah. That one was like... I had never, ever had anything done like I was low-key kind of scary. <laughs> I was like, wait, shit. But you liked it. I was like, is my head like still attached to my body? Did you feel it all the way down the back? Yeah, yeah. and I didn't know, I didn't remember, I didn't know if I could like get up. I was like, wait, <laughs> can I stand? You made it. I did. <laughs> it felt are. really good. Lift your head up for me. Back down. All right. So just nice and relaxed here. You don't have to do anything. Okay. Breath in for me. Let it out. Oh, wow. That was insane. Wow. All right, I can get up. Can you move your feet? Well. Wiggle your toes? Yeah. <laughs> feel it all the way down? Yeah. That was insane. I feel taller. Can I get your hips real quick? Yeah, absolutely. Lay on your back for me. Okay. We're going to do this hip first, just nice and relaxed. Good. Oh, I, I don't know if we did this one last time. Really? I don't remember this. We might have too. skipped it. I bet I skipped it because you were saying that you didn't know if you could move your legs, so we probably had <laughs> yeah, you sit up so like, you couldn't yeah. move. Yeah. You can sit up now. Yeah, I think that was Probably, all right, let's let her move her legs a little bit. <laughs> I don't know if I can stand. Yeah. But that was great. Thank you How'd so much. How did everything feel? Good. Like, everything just got released. Like, it feels really good. It's easier the second time around? Yeah, a lot easier the second time around. And I think there's a lot more range of motion now, too, because 